so here is my new bed set it's the lacy print quilt cover set which i love and then i've got the arlo stonewash fitted sheet and also three uh, European pillowcases. Oh, and I nearly forgot this one too, is the two pack pillowcases as well. I'm going to pop all of these into the wash and um, put them on my bed. Can't beat Aldi roses, only $12. This here is a mulberry silk pillowcase and I picked this up from Pillow Talk. Welcome to my spring bedroom makeover video. I'm so excited to show you what we've been up to. I love how it's turned out. It's really bright and fresh and just got that really beautiful spring vibe. I've even dressed up for you today in a little blue dress just to match all the bedding. Moved a lot of things around and I've changed things up. I will show you what the room looked like before for our, my winter makeover. Here's a quick little look.
And here is the after. As I did the three bird styling school, um, I went through a lot of the tips in my last video, which I will link below and I'll link it here for you. Um, so this time I have incorporated all of those things again and I'm also trying to implement some Feng Shui. I am very, very new at this and really have my old plates on, um, but I do practice the principles of the secret and it's one of the principles in that is to get the energy right in your bedroom, your office and also in your living room. So I'm going to try and incorporate a little bit of that into this spring series. Um, but like I said, I'm only learning. I really don't know much about it. I've just implemented a couple of things that I wouldn't have normally done um, but in hopes that it will help bring in my manifestations, which I'm very hopeful for. Um, and also um, just to get the just to get the right energy flow in in my home. So your bedroom is your sanctuary and it's really important to make it just feel really safe and cozy and just a place that you really want to be. I know sometimes, you know, clutter can build up and it can just get a little crazy in your bedroom, but it's really feels so much better and so much better for your soul when everything's in its place and it just makes you feel really calm and serene, which is what your bedroom is all about. I'm trying to incorporate little bits of Feng Shui into my home. I don't know very much about it. I really have my L plates on, but I, I do practice the secret and I did find a lady named Mari Diamond and she's a Feng Shui master and I have been doing her courses. So I'm learning a lot about how to make the energy flow perfectly in your room. I'm learning to place items and colors in particular areas to get the energy perfect in your home. So I am working on that. I'm really excited. I'm learning a lot, but I really don't know very much at all. So I won't go into it in too much depth. What I will do is though is I'll, I'll link down the bottom her website and on her website you can actually get your energy number which will then be very specific to you and where you need to place things in your home. I'm a number seven so you can get her free app and there is a compass on that and you put in your birthday and your gender and it will come up with your perfect energy number which will then guide you on where that you need to put items and things in your home. Um, so you might find that I've put some things where I probably wouldn't have normally done actually uh, in hopes that it's going to um, bring my manifestations to life and also just have a really good vibe through my home. So I will go through little things with you but like I said I'm only learning so I don't want to um, give you too much information on it as I don't want to give you the wrong information <laughs> as I'm only learning um, but I will link everything down below and a couple of videos as well just so that way you can um, you know if you're interested in that then you've got that information there at your fingertips. I wanted to show you what I've changed up. So this is my husband's side of the bed. Um, we've got his great grandmother's beautiful mirror here. And in Feng Shui, they do say not to have a mirror in your bedroom, especially if it's facing the bed. 
Um, so with this mirror, it actually just reflects the cupboard and the window. So I'm hoping that's going to be okay on the energy front. If not, I'm uh, actually uh, planning to possibly swap that out with an artwork that we have out in the lounge room. Um, but I'm just waiting to see what I'm going to do. <laughs> So let me go through all the items and show you what each of the things are and what I did and why I placed them where I've placed them. <laughs> okay, so starting on my husband's side of the bed. So I've decided to add in these beautiful peace lily plants. Now you do have to be careful what plants that you actually do put in your room, um, being that they can emit carbon monoxide at night time so you do need to make sure that you've got plants that are safe for the bedroom these ones actually do produce oxygen at all times so these are perfect to have in your bedroom actually when you google it it's one of the first plants that come up that's great for your bedroom so it's got this beautiful little flower there because there's not many flower, um, flowering plants that are indoors so I do really like this so my plant stand ended up working out great from Big W. Um, I love those. That was in the haul from last week. And then this lamp is also from Kmart. I love that. The trays from Kmart. The little vases from Kmart. That is me there at my wedding. <laughs> and um, these are little crystal coasters. Bedside tables and the bed we did get from Harvey Norman, but I did get those a few years ago now. At the end of the day, I put all my little cushions into the basket here, and then it's a neat little spot for them to all go. So that's why we have that there. The European pillowcases are all from Target, and then this is the Target set, which was only $35, and I really love it. I love how it looks. I love the navy and white. It's just so fresh. And my two little cushions on either side were both from Target, but I've had them for quite some time. They do have something similar there at the moment, and that's like a linen. I'll show you up close. And that's sort of like a linen. And then that, my pillowcases are part of the bedding. This is the Arlo Stone Wash, which I really love the look of, that it's sort of that more, I just like the texture that they give. Um, and then this is the beautiful pillow, which I just love. It's like a linen with a rose gold um, palm leaf on there, which I think will look great when I just have a plain white bedding as well. But I do like the little pop of natural color on the bed as well, because I have the tray there. And I just think it kind of brings it all together. It does look great even without that, but since I bought it, I've just popped it on there. And I really like the warmth that it brings into the room. And here we've got our little Zara throw from Kmart. That's turned out great. This little tray is from Kmart as well. I use this when I'm editing or reading books or if I'm eating in bed. <laughs> it's my little stable table. Um, this is one of my favorite books and I reference it all the time. So it's called Super Attractor by Gabrielle Bernstein and I just love it. And then coming over to this side here, so we've got a wedding photo. That's me and my husband there on our wedding day. And um, our photographer was able to capture my husband writing love. Isn't that gorgeous? I just love that picture so much. <laughs> on my side of the bed here, I do also have a matching plant. That's my little peace lily. It's just beautiful. And then I love how I'm a little, I love a little bit of matchy matchy, which I think is also great for the feng shui. Um, the tray, also matches so we've got this the tray from Kmart and then our bunny um and the big w little plant holder there and then this is my rock salt oil diffuser and my oils that i love i did show you these in the haul that i did the other week um and then i've just got some crystals here this little shawowski crystal um thing here is is from my bridal bouquet in from my wedding so i love to have that there um and then i've just got some i've got some rose quartz and some amethyst and some little crystals there this little butterfly is something from my mum so it's just nice to have a couple little sentimental things there and then i've got a little crystal vase with some roses and the roses are from aldi <laughs> um, my matching bedside table um that matches over there so the little table that I have over here, the reason why I've put that there, which might seem a little bit strange, but there's a method to my madness. <laughs> I've actually added that there as that is where my success direction is. Um, my success direction is Northwest. And that is where that is particularly. For my number, for number seven, she did suggest to have something gold, something blue or royal blue, 
the yellow is for wisdom. So all the little things that I've got there actually all have meaning. So if you're interested in that, I won't go into it now, otherwise we'll have a massive long video. Uh, but if you're interest, interested in, in it, let me know. Um, but like I said, I will link it all down below so you can make your own decision and, and find out because it is very particular to you as a person. So that's why this is here. But let's let me go through and show you what is there. <laughs> So this little table here is from Kmart. It is gorgeous. I love this one. I'm actually going to get pick up another one, but it is, it is the marble side table from Kmart and I love it. With the feng shui, Mari Diamond did say, in your success direction for my number, she said to put something blue and gold, which is for abundance, basically. <laughs> it's, a, it's very in-depth. I'm not even 100% sure I'm going to put all of this into my video as it is quite a lot to understand. Um, but basically, this is to activate my success direction. So uh, um, I'm giving it a go <laughs> and fingers crossed it works. So I've got, one, I've got my favorite book here, which is The Greatest Secret from The Secret Series by Rhonda Byrne. I've got a beautiful crystal there, which I just love. And it's also got the gold there as well, which will activate my feng shui. I've got my little goddess symbol, which is in blue, which is also recommended to do. I've got my little candle holder there, which is in aqua. And then I've got a gorgeous gold vase, which is the gold represents the abundance and the yellow there is for wisdom. And then I've got my gold vase from Pillow Talk. This little vase is from Pillow Talk as well. The roses are from Aldi. The crystal is from Ishka. My little goddess here, I've had for many, many years, probably 20 years, I'd say. It's something I can't link for you, unfortunately. I was actually given this as a gift from a friend. I'm coming into here, which is my bathroom. So this is my little ensuite. Hi. I've added in my little plant from Bunnings, which I love. I've, this is my little Target basket. And I've got my little face washes here all rolled up, ready to go for when I wash my face. I love the smell of this um, hand wash, which is, I showed you that in my one of my, my latest hauls. And then coming over here, I've just got Kmart, my little terrazzo set from Kmart. And I've got this cute little bowl that I just pop my rings and things in when I'm, when I'm having a shower. My favorite perfume. And normally my little toothbrushes are in here, but I did put them away just for you guys. <laughs> And then coming over here is these beautiful towel set, which is the Canning Vale, the hotel collection towel set that I showed you in my haul. They look great. I love the navy and white. And for $20 for that whole set there, it's amazing. Um, absolute bargain. And I do think that they look really lovely. The light's actually throwing and making it a different color, but they are very white with a really lovely navy white stripe. And my little washing basket there was from Kmart. It's just a little rose gold um, washing basket. But that's basically everything in the bathroom. I do have some lush stuff that I'm waiting on. Um, and when that arrives, I will show you that as well because I love washing myself in lush. <laughs> we do also have our massive LG TV in our bedroom as well. And it is on one of the little arms so you can flip it out or push it back against the wall. Um, we didn't have a TV in our room for such a long time, but as the years have gone on and the kids were little babies, we decided to get a TV. So I love it. I love having a TV um, <laughs> in the bedroom. I know a lot of people don't like it, but I don't mind it. <laughs> so I just wanted to talk about a couple of extra things that I did buy for the bedroom, which I may use alternatively when this set is in the wash. I do have three huge haul videos prior to this video. I'll link them all down below. Please check them out because there's so many items that I'm going to be using over the My Spring Home Makeover series. I'm going to use this one as my alternate one when this is in the wash. So it's just a plain white set, which I love. Um, and this is called the Arlo Stone Wash Quilt Cover Set. And this is what it looks like. I also have this one here, which is from Target. Um, you can't do returns at the moment because we are in lockdown. So I think I will end up returning this, but I do think it would look lovely with just the white set. I was going to use it for this, um, but I'm just not a fan of just sort of the texture of this one. I do like this 
more sort of soft, uh, cozy kind of vibe more than this one. So I just wanted to show it to you as it is an option and I think it will look great. Um, if, you're, if you do like this, I think that you're, it's a great option. And finally, I did tell you in my haul video that I was waiting on a couple of items and they, they finally arrived. This was from mydeal.com.au and these are luxury silk pillowcases. They were $35 each. I've got these as a backup and you can see how beautiful they are there. So for $35, that's a great deal. Um, I will say that I think that the Pillow Talk one that I did buy, which you would have seen in the haul, um, is a better quality, but these are still 100% mulberry silk, and if you're on a budget, these are great. Very excited, the Lush order arrived. Okay, what have we got in here? I forgot what I bought, it's taken a month to get here. <laughs> so we've got the Celestial Face Moisturizer, which I love that one. Rose Argan, okay, body conditioner. Okay, so this is after you wash your body, you put this on and then you rinse it off and your skin's all nice and soft. Gosh, I don't know what that is. It's a little sample that they must have sent me. Oh, I'm excited. We've got the Sleepy Shower Gel. It's gonna be good. Oh, it smells, oh. <laughs> it smells delicious and it's purple. <laughs> Whoopsie. <laughs> okay, and then, oh, let me give a note of what it is. Oh, these are the little scrubby, scrubby bees, which are so cute. They've got little, granule, little granules in it and you rub that on your body in the shower. It moisturizes you, but it also scrubs your body. And that's a little, oh, <laughs> a little scrubby bee. And, also, I think keep in your refrigerator. Ah, oh, and then a nice, another little sort of moisturizing bar, massage bar, which will be nice. I'll get my husband to give me a massage. <laughs> and that's it. So I'm very excited that these have finally arrived. We can put them in the shower. So today is our eight year wedding anniversary. We've got a very special drink of the week to celebrate. We've got the Paul Rouge, it's the French Champagne. So we'll open it up. So eight years ago. <laughs> It's a very pretty bottle. It's lovely. So yes, eight years ago we got married. It was the most beautiful day ever. If you go to my Instagram, you'll be able to see a photos from our wedding, which was just my favorite day ever. Okay. Ooh. Eight years now. Another little one. Good champagne, people. Is it bussin'? Bussin', bussin'. <laughs> Thank you.
hope you enjoyed today's video. Um, I've, I've really enjoyed making over my bedroom. I, it just feels so calming and soothing and such a nice place to be. I actually have been spending so much more time in here now reading and editing my videos just because it's got such a beautiful vibe here now. So I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you like what we did. Uh, please let me know your favorite items and if you have any other ideas of what I can do, please check out my Instagram as I'll have all the detailed photos there. You can make a little file and press save and then that way you'll have it all there. So when you go to the shops, if you like anything, you'll be able to purchase it. And it just makes it easier on Instagram to do that. But otherwise I'll have everything linked down the bottom as much as I can. I end up having so many things linked that I'm I've run out of space on my description box, but hopefully uh, everything will be linked there. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask me as I love hearing from you guys. Please comment and like this video if you enjoyed it. Have an amazing week, guys. We've had a big week this week with our wedding anniversary and everything. And um, how cute is he? <laughs> All right, we'll say goodbye, Teddy. Okay, thanks so much for watching, guys. We'll see you next week. Bye. And my six, six, my six, oh, that's, that's a tough one to get out. <laughs> to, um, I'm learning to. This here is actually something, for, um, this little shorts you place a cobalt, cobalt, oh gosh, I can't get my words out. So I just thought I'd talk, um, so I'll just, I'll just show you each of the items and explain everything that we did. Instagram as I will have all the photos, all the deep. <laughs> yeah. Go. Welcome to my, welcome to my spring. So I've got my three Arlo, my, my three, the three. So I've got across the top here is the three. Um, please don't hesitate to comment on, oh. Please, um, please comment. Um, I'm very excited. I've dressed up for you today in a little spring outfit just to um, to bring to bring in the blue colour. Oh, hang on. <laughs> hang on. I make these videos for you, so please let me know of anything. Um, please let me know. I'm going to this. <laughs> <laughs> this is not dainty at all. I'm also trying and very only and very new and um, you know to bring in the spring. I'm really ex oh god, hang on. Go. So this time around, um, so last time I actually, so last time, um, as I did the three birds, um, uh, I don't even know if I'm going to put that in. Okay, so we've decided, maybe I should have stand over here. So I've, I've changed a lot of, I've, I've, I've maybe got it going. I've, and <laughs> Got so much for the bloopers now. <laughs> Had our nice lunch and now it is the you know war. <laughs> Lockdown anniversary lunch. Who's gonna win? Me. Mummy. <laughs> <laughs> Join our family, please like and subscribe. <laughs> Join our waffles. One, two, three. Join, Join our family, please.
Please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.